Welcome to another episode of Trap Nature, y'all. I got a special treat for y'all. It's October, it's tarantula season, and I came out here strictly for the Bay Area Blind Tarantula. Stay tuned. find them all over the Bay Area, from the East Bay to the North Bay to the South Bay. They all over the place. But this is a Bay Area blind tarantula. He's actually out right now looking for a female. It's breeding season. All through October, from the beginning of October towards, I would say, the mid towards the end of October, they go be out here looking for females. And when they're out like this, they only live to one, one or three years. So he's actually gonna breed and then once he breeds, he's gonna die. He's gonna keep walking into the cold season and he's gonna either freeze to death or a coyote go pick him up. But he's not gonna live after this breeding session. So his whole objective is to find a female to breed with. So this is a Bay Area blind tarantula, the only tarantula species. We have the false tarantula too, which is um, actually a, a Calisoga spider. They call them false tarantulas because they're actually large spiders that look like this tarantula, but they imitate this tarantula. They don't get as big as this tarantula either, and they're not as hairy. But this is the Bay Area blind tarantula, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, I'm in the California hills, and I'm out here looking for tarantulas. It's tarantula season. So let's see what I can find out here. Uh, most likely there are thousands of males walking all around here right now looking for females. They're gonna be doing this for the next two to three weeks until they either die off or coyotes eat them off. But it's gonna be a bunch of males roaming this whole field right here. And I'm about to go see what I can find. Hopefully I can find a female too to show you the size difference. It's a, it's a big difference between the males and females. The females are almost double the size of the males. They have uh, wider uh, butts, uh, wider bodies. So let me go out here and try to see what I can find and I'll get back to you. Trap Nature, stay tuned. I'm gonna try to get him out this road though because I don't want him getting hit. So let me scoot him that way. Go ahead, man, get up get out this road before you get hit. That way, that way. That way, that way. There you go. I'm gonna get him going this direction so he can get out the road. He was going towards the street. That's not a good idea, little tarantula. The Bay Area blind tarantula, ladies and gentlemen. A lot of people don't even know we have tarantulas out here in the Bay. But yeah, we do. Nature, 2021. I'm out. He's a press of canary. He's a very, he's a rare all white. Got papers for him and everything. Bloodline. He came uh, from a family of Brendels. He's the only white one that came out like this, out of several family generations. But he come, he come from a line of Brendels. And we had one odd puppy, which came out all white, and it was this one. So I decided to keep this one. Just because he came out different from the rest of the pack. He's uh, approaching a year old. He's gonna be my new hiking partner. This is Masai, my male, rare, all white pressed canary. Canary dog. The Bay Area blind tarantula. And remember, you don't never grab this spider. If you grab him, they could bite you or they will kick off those hairs. If you look in the back, you see those hairs? They will kick those hairs off and those hairs will get all in your nose. They will get all in your eyes, they irritate your eyes. And trust me, you have a bad day if one of these hairs get on you. They're very irritating. This is the Bay Area Blind Tarantula, ladies and gentlemen. The only tarantula species we have living out here in the Bay Area. 
I'm gonna let him go about his way because he's looking for a female. Look, y'all, that's an American bald eagle, y'all. Where'd he go? There we go. There's an American bald eagle right there. He's eating, he caught something. And he's eating. See the white head keep popping up? With the black body? That's a large American, look, he just dug down again. That is a large American bald eagle. I wish I could get closer, but it's a fence standing between me and this bird. So I can't get closer. But that is definitely an American bald eagle. You guys see the white head with the black body? He's eating something he caught and he keep ducking his head down like he's picking the meat from it. Well, yeah, y'all, that's an American bald eagle. Sun's going down. It's starting to get dark. Just the way I like it out here. Nice and dark. When the sun goes down, a lot of animals, interesting animals come out. So let's see what we what we may find. It's the third night in a row. It's the third night in a row. There's some owls came and surrounded me. They on this side and they on this side too. There's a pair of them. Those are great horned owls. 